are here with Tony Jones, and we'd like to ask you a few questions so we can get to know you a little better. That would be fine. Wonderful. First question, where did you grow up? I'm from the great state of Virginia. I spent most of my life there and moved away for college. I've been away ever since. Oh, nice. So, you know a lot about your wife's family, but can you tell us about your family? Yeah, sure. My parents are Harry and Marilyn Jones. They've been married for over 50 years. Then, I have an older sister, Ebony. We don't get to see her very often because she travels the world building orphanages for children. The work she does is amazing. That is incredible work your sister is doing. And over 50 years? Wow, that's really inspiring. Speaking of your parents, what qualities do you admire about them? I admire their love and devotion to one another. They've always been supportive of each other and respected each other's individuality. This overflowed to us. They'd allowed us to be ourselves and not who they wanted us to be. That's nice, just to be able to be yourself. What's the best part of being a father and a husband? As a father, I love that I'm able to allow my children to be who they want to be, and in turn, they respect me enough to follow my advice and leadership. Basically, I do what my parents have done for me. As for being a husband, I love having Sandra by my side. We really help enhance each other, and I know I wouldn't be who I am today if it wasn't for her. Aw, that's so sweet. I'm sure Sandra will appreciate those kind words. So, Tony, what do you do for a living? I'm a software engineer. I enjoy my work and it helps keep the family afloat. In my spare time, I tinker with cards with my good friend, Gio. That's a nice hobby. Is there anything else you like to do in your spare time? I like listening to music. What kind of music do you like listening to? <laughs> oh, I love listening to jazz music. You just feel every note and every beat in your soul. You make it sound so appealing. I'll have to give it another listen. Do you play any sports for leisure? Well, I'm quite athletic, and I played soccer in high school and college. I really enjoy the game, and I still play with my son and coach a little. I'm trying to get my girls to use their natural athleticism, but that's a bit more of a challenge. My wife and I also go to the gym regularly. It's important for us to keep our bodies strong. Well, okay, Mr. Strongman. Let me ask you, what is your idea of a perfect vacation? Hmm, perfection is hard to come by, but I'd say a month-long cruise in the Caribbean with my wife, and maybe Gio and Kathy can join us. That would be a cool couple vacation. So, romance is important to you. Oh, yes, very much so. Okay, so what's the craziest thing you've done for love? <laughs> well, back in college, I paid this guy $40 a week to get to class early and save me a seat so I could sit next to Sandra. She was so beautiful and interesting, and I just wanted to get to know her better. That was the best money I spent in my entire life. I'd spend even more for the outcome it's had because that beautiful lady is now my wife. I'm one lucky fella. Aw, that's so romantic. It just melts my heart. Tell us something interesting about yourself. Well, I'm left-handed, and my first name is just Tony. Most people think my name is short for Anthony, but really, it's just Tony. That is interesting. This is the last question, Tony. If there's one thing you could have done in your life that you haven't done, what would it be? I don't live my life in regret. I'm so blessed with all the Lord has given me. Also, I'm a firm believer in not limiting yourself. And if you want to do something, there's no better time like the present. One thing I continually strive to be is an upstanding man of God that my family can be proud of and be an example to them of how to live a fulfilled life. Great answer, Tony. Thanks so much for allowing us to get a glimpse of who you are. We'll let you get back to those smooth sounds of jazz. Thank you, and just let that velvety tone flow through you.
But you, Timothy, are a man of God, so run from all these evil things. Pursue righteousness and a godly life, along with faith, love, perseverance, and gentleness. 1 Timothy chapter 6, verse 11.